All right, everybody, welcome back to another live stream. Today, we are going to be playing some Splatoon 2. Turns out there's no, uh, uh, there's no Grizzco, so we're gonna, unfortunately, not have ourselves some Salmon Run. But we'll go through the private battle. Should be fun, should be exciting. But welcome back, everybody. Dink, how's it going? Hala, Alleguin, Alex, uh, Christian, Sparkle, and Nathaniel, Master Smash. Hopefully, you all had a fantastic Friday. Echo, how's it going? Welcome back. Mason, how's it going? Hopefully you guys' Fridays were fantastic as well. But yeah, we're going to start with uh, the first mode. Uh, Turf War. That is what that mode is called. Definitely did not forget it. Alejandro, how's it going? Eevee, Copa Gaming, Epic Zack Games, Unch. Welcome back as well. Hopefully you guys are excited for the weekend. Hopefully you guys are done with school. If not, good luck. <laughs> it's probably almost over. And Dragon King, how's it going? Welcome back to the stream. Oh, there we go. That's eight. Can we stop it at 8? No way. Wow. Getting right on with the games. That's that's great. Honestly, never really happens. Alright. Oh, Dragon King, sadly, you do not have this game. Do you ever plan to get this game? It's actually not a bad game. It's really fun. Unless you're getting sniped all of the time, but then you learn. You try and learn from that. <laughs> Pikachu, how's it going? Welcome back to the stream. Nada, welcome back. Been a while. Hopefully you had a good week. Oh, today was your last day of school? I'm sure you had a, well, maybe week full of exams. You're probably going to have a pretty awesome weekend. So that's good to hear. Dank, you have one more week of uh, school. Hopefully it's not too bad. Hopefully it's not too bad, like, test and exam wise. But we'll probably do maybe around 30 or more minutes of each mode. Kind of go through them in chronological order. Oh, speaking of snipers. Just get one person. There we go. Now you can take me out. No? Yes? Maybe so? There we go. <laughs> it only took two shots. Disney Cards, how's it going? Welcome back to the stream. Hopefully you had a pretty awesome Friday and week. And Echo, you got eight more days of school? That's not too bad. Wait. Eight more days of school, so you have a, uh, a week and a few days after that week? After next week? Alright, that was just... Connor, come on, man. That was a little... A little rough there. <laughs> Can you really... <laughs> Never seen that one before. That's kind of cool. You're about to throw a grenade? For a second there, I thought they put a moat in this game. I was, I was gonna be like... Alright. Why not? And where else is it going? Welcome back to the stream. Ultra Moon and Link. Cool gamer, bro. Hopefully you guys had fantastic Fridays. Did I hear they might make the Switch cheaper? I heard they're selling it without the dock. Which is, um, interesting. I don't really, well, I mean, I personally need the dock, but I can see why some people might not really need it. Oh, come on. Oh, that's right. I can just move on over here. <laughs> oh, GG. Nice. Should have figured that was going to happen. Oh, Echo, uh, there are two days off, so yeah, I guess because school ends June 7th. It's really soon. How are we looking, team? Oh, we're not looking too good. Hopefully we can improve. Oh, I think we are. I got to keep away from them. David, how's it going? Welcome back to the stream. Hopefully you had a fantastic Friday as well. And Pikachu, yes, I did get a haircut. There was a wedding I had to go to and I wanted to kind of look a little sharp. At least a little sharper than uh, what I used to look. Also, it's getting really warm outside, so decided why not. Got to do it eventually. Oh, not the rain. That's just worse. And Pichu, how's it going? Welcome back as well. And Unch, today at school you got your yearbook signed? Did they, like, allot some time to do that? I can't remember if they, like, allowed us some free time to kind of go do that during school. Although we did have kind of like a field day thing toward the end. And that was kind of, you know, a lot of people did that sort of thing. And Alejandro... My Friday was not too bad. I got to see Solo. That was 
pretty awesome movie. Highly recommend if you're a fan of Star Wars to go see that movie. But it was pretty good, all things considered. The day. Alex, you just did a 1v3 sort of thing? Oh, did you, like, take out three people? Oh, six requests. All right. That's not too many. Not too many yet. Oh, you also had a minimal uh, minimum day today? What is a minimum day, Hunch? Is that like a half day? And in uh, Dragon King, I did try to stream Minecraft before for the Switch edition twice. It uh, <laughs> just uh, doesn't really work as well as you would think it would. I mean, they have mini games, which is great. So you could kind of set it up to everybody, you know, joining a mini game like in all the other games I stream. But the chat kind of gets a little... Uh, a little ridiculous. Maybe in the future we'll try it somehow, but I mean, it's not looking like it's going to be anytime soon. Unless we could get a game where everybody can join. That's kind of the only, uh, I would love to play like Minecraft Adventure Mode if everybody could join. Oh, minimum day is a half day? That makes sense. Unless it's a day where you just put in minimal effort. <laughs> I guess that might be the kind of same. And Eric, how's it going? Oh, welcome back to the stream. Hopefully you had a fantastic Friday, and Shinobi, welcome back as well. Oh, Shinobi, you're officially on vacation right now? How long's your vacation? I'm guessing it's summer vacation. <laughs> Why, hello, it me. Will, how's it going? Welcome back. It definitely you. Hopefully you had a pretty awesome week. And Tunis, welcome back. Hopefully your week was awesome as well. Also, now I gotta check to see... Who could have been in the last one? You were... Is this 10 people joining? I think it is. You weren't. I don't think you were. I wish there was a better way to do this. Aha, you were. So I think that's 4v4. Alright. Oh, YouTube has been glitching for streamers today? It looks fine on your end now, though. What was going on? I know, like, yesterday we had the whole... Everybody was becoming a moderator, so... You know, congrats to everybody who got that, but, uh, <laughs> it was taken away. <laughs> and Disney, if you have sent a request, uh, after every game, I do check. So, eventually I'll probably get to it. And I think I have about 116 open, uh, available positions on my friends list. Friends thing, whatever it's called. So, there should be plenty of room, hopefully. And Jimmy, how's it going? And Dylan, a welcome back. Hopefully you guys had fantastic Fridays as well. And Caleb, welcome back. Hopefully you're excited for the weekend. <laughs> Legit YouTube is very fixed, 100% sure. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with YouTube, ever. Nope. No siree. YouTube is 100% fine. And right. In every way. Shape and form. And Jamil, how's it going? Oh, welcome to the stream. You're not on vacation until... Oh, the 20th? Oh man, that's pretty late. Oh, Shinobi, you're on vacation until Friday. That's not too bad. That's a pretty good amount of time. Unless you mean this Friday, but I don't think you do. So you got about a week. Uh-oh, Blue's taking over everybody. It's not good. Gotta stop them. Let's go, uh, Team Amy. Just because we're on that team. And Sylvia, how's it going? Welcome back to the stream. Hopefully you had a wonderful Friday. Make the jump? Okay, we're good. Almost didn't make it. Oh, I'm dead. Nope. Not dead. Oh, you ran away. Get back here. I wasn't done. The fight must go on. Nice. Maybe I'll change to my P90. It was really fun going with the whole uh, main sub and then special kind of uh, combination. Kind of miss that. Can't really do this with uh, the brush. Oh, Sylvia, you did? How about me? It wasn't too bad. Went to go to the movies. That was fun. 
Other than that, didn't really do too much today. That's right. Good luck sniping me from over there. Oh, I'm out of ink. This is not good. Unshu did zero work at school today. I mean, if it's a half day, I, I doubt you would actually do anything. I mean, what teacher's is gonna give you, like, work to do on a half day? That's... that's kind of mean. There we go. Nice try, Echo. GG. You almost got me, though. That was pretty close. Oh, alright. Who knew you were there? I did, but it was too late. And Leo, how's it going? Oh, welcome back. Hopefully you had a fantastic Friday as well. Oh, they definitely... Man, they took middle. But we got the middle of middle, but that's not enough points, is it? Nope. They probably got it. Summer homework? 300 pages of work? Dragon King, you really have summer homework? That does not sound great. <laughs> David, your history teacher gives work on half days. Like, there's not even enough time. Like, do- does the entire- do all classes, like, get cut in half time-wise, or like, do you just show up to half of them? I can't really remember what my classes did. I think we just got out of them eventually. Like, we only did, uh, a couple of the classes or something like that. And Leo, if you do, in fact, hate somebody in this chat, uh, I mean, you should probably take that outside the chat and not really in the chat. Just kind of a waste of space. Oh, there's one more. Can't leave anybody behind. Oh, Jacob, you had a rally today? It was, uh, like an assembly where there's uh, dances and announcements. It took a while. Yeah, aren't those usually, like, isn't that kind of a half day? Leads into a, uh, an assembly day, something like that? Usually probably take around a couple hours. Where everybody's just sitting there. They play music. I just wanted to feel like I wanted to leave and play video games. <laughs> Well, Leo, if someone tells you to shut up in the chat, I mean, you should probably just ignore them. That is the best thing to do. But if you're gonna, you know, kind of stoop down to the same level, um, I'm only really gonna notice, you know, as soon as I notice. The best thing to do is just not do anything about it. It's people online. I mean, that's gonna happen. I think Litos, you were in the last one. And that does make 4v4. And Murph, how's it going? Welcome back to the stream. Hopefully you had a fantastic Friday and your computer's working. Well, that's good. Did you- you got your monitor, right? And Jacob, honestly, I have no idea what that is. Um... And the ink machine? Is that a video game? And Skyflyer, welcome back to the stream as well. And Sylvia, if it is a joke, I'm not gonna take it as that. I'm sorry, but if I'm seeing somebody calling someone something or, you know, telling them to shut up or anything like that, and, you know, just... It's a waste of space in my chat. I don't want people to start arguing with each other in the chat. Even if they're kind of just friends. It, maybe if I'm also in on it, but I'm not, so I have no idea, like, who to believe. Oh, and aren't your teacher was kind of mean, but also nice? I mean, some teachers could be mean, and some teachers could be nice. Some teachers could be the mean nice, where they're, like, really mean, but they're just joking, I guess. <laughs> oh, Marshawn, I press done as soon as you join? I mean, if I see enough people, I'm gonna try and hurry up the game as, as quickly as possible. Alright, where are they? Yeah, that's not gonna make it. 
There we go, I did all I could. Any rock, welcome back to the stream. Oh, run away. <laughs> you came up this way. <laughs> nice try. We rock, if you can't watch the stream today, that's fine. I mean, nobody's obligated to watch the stream or anything like that, but uh, hopefully you have a pretty awesome rest of your day. Oh no, that's not good. That's not yellow. Come on, get out of here. Retro time, how's it going? Welcome back to the stream. You have arrived. And it's, you know, 15 minutes late. That's not too bad. Definitely better than an hour or two late. There we go, that took a lot of hits. Oh, Echo, how is programming gone? It's gone pretty good. Just, uh... Nothing really changes too much about it. It does take a while to implement really anything. Oh, come on. The other side of the pole. That's what I should have done. Great. Tomorrow, though, is gonna be an entire day of probably 12 straight hours of programming, because... I'm probably gonna rewrite the entire engine again just to... Like, there are things now that I'm working on that I could have prepared better for. I just didn't know I had to, like, think about them in the first stages of developing the engine, so I gotta kind of rewrite it better. Which is kind of fun, but it does take a lot of time. Oh, we're doing really good, team. Oh, no. Where'd you go? Oh, you just stopped. What a change of direction, man. Oh yeah, Eevee. I mean, a lot of people are hacking the game. You can't really... I mean, it's a, uh, it's an exploit that I understand from people where you can't actually patch it. Also, you can potentially get banned from, uh, hacking the Switch, but I mean, that's really on them. So, I'm sure they under- I'm sure David understands everything about what he's doing. Also, not gonna lie, it's, uh, you know, any sort of thing that's hackable, like your level in a game, should not be client-side. Nintendo should really keep those on the server, like they keep the, uh, I think your rank is on the server. Because that's a little bit more difficult to try and uh, change the values of. Yeah, Pikachu, I don't really feel good about hacking, but as long as it doesn't do anything to gameplay. Like, if anybody hacks a level, I don't really care about levels. Unless, of course, it relates to any sort of leaderboard, but in this case, I don't think it does too much. I don't, I'm not sure, I don't think the levels in this game actually go to some sort of global leaderboards or anything like that, but if they were to hack things like, um, mechanics that would, like, give them an advantage in the game, that's, that's completely terrible. But I don't think that is necessarily true unless, like, they're hacking new weapons, but I think Nintendo's done something about that at least, maybe? Like, at least keeping an eye on who's doing that so you might get banned sooner. Oh, we're all the first eight, not in the last one, except for me? And Jeffrey, how's it going? Welcome back. Hopefully you had a fantastic Friday. Oh, Eloquent, how did I friend myself? I mean, that was probably someone else. I definitely was somebody else. <laughs> and did I see Ready Player One? Yeah, I think, uh, I'm pretty sure I saw it. Yeah, I saw it twice. Still really good the second time. And Savage Nublet, welcome back to the stream. Hopefully you had a fantastic Friday as well. Yeah, Hala, I do have to spectate two people. So, in order to keep it fair, I do have to go, uh, I usually go down the list, and if nobody of the, uh, second two 
eight position have joined before, I am forced to spectate anybody after that. It's just... You're really gonna have to blame Nintendo because you have to spectate people, unfortunately. And Jameson, welcome back to the stream. Hopefully you had a fantastic Friday as well. Oh yeah, cool gamer. I mean, people did kind of, you know, did some things to, uh, like, cheat the uh, jump roping challenge or anything like that, but, I mean, what can you really do? <laughs> Will, you bought the $80 cardboard box. How do I feel? I don't feel any different. Uh, you bought it. That's your money. Depends on what you do with it. Actually, it doesn't really depend on what you do with it. If you enjoy it, you enjoy it. Well, Hala, if you try joining next time, there is always the chance seven more people ahead of you could join first that have not been in a game previously. And I'm only looking at one past game. So it is, again, first come, first serve for the most part. And unfortunately, I'm not even, I don't have like host privileges to any of the lobbies I start. Nintendo doesn't really do that sort of thing. They keep it very simplified for some reason. And cool gamer, please be careful with the amount of emojis. It does kind of take up space in the chat and has been a little difficult to follow along with the chat recently. And Murph, you have an ethernet problem? I am just seeing this now. I'm sorry, man. It's hard to keep up while trying to pay attention to the game a little bit. There might be drivers you need to be installed. Um, if it's like not working properly. But usually there shouldn't be a problem. I'm guessing you can't connect it to the internet? Where'd they go? One of my teammates just died here. Oh, there are two of you! I think I got one. Definitely got one. Aurora, how's it going? Welcome back to the stream. Am I streaming Mario Tennis Aces tournament demo? Uh, I might be able to. That is gonna be, um... Next weekend, right? If it's next weekend, uh, I might actually update the schedule to do that. Is it just going to be online multiplayer we're able to do? Yeah, Murph, unfortunately, I'm not going to know the drivers. Um, I mean, the motherboard's manufacturer should have something on their website. Maybe that's related to their um, Ethernet drivers because those... Um, those nicks are actually on the motherboard, I believe, like the, uh, where you plug in the ethernet. And Ulysses, how's it going? Welcome back to the stream. Hopefully you had a pretty awesome day. Murph, do you know what type of motherboard you got? I mean, I am really only familiar with, uh, MSI motherboards. They should just kind of work, uh without really anything being done to them, even in the BIOS. Like, I believe some, uh, if not most MSI motherboards have, like, a BIOS uh, OS kind of thing. I think it's just Linux running in the background or something. And to Joker, how's it going? And Lena, welcome back. Hopefully you guys had pretty awesome Fridays. Oh, you did the driver thing? Uh, you got from the website and it still did nothing? So wait, what is the issue? It's just... Uh, is there something you could tell me about, like... Oh, it is the MSI motherboard? There shouldn't really be an issue with MSI and... Having it... So wait, you're plugging in Ethernet to your computer and you're just not getting internet? You were in the last one. Who else was in the last one? I think that's 10 who joined. Okay. Well, Hala, have a good one. Thanks for stopping by. 
And Elysius will go through all of the modes kind of equally. So for now, for the next probably 10 or more minutes, we'll keep doing some Turf War. Master Smash, I have not tried the demo for Sushi Striker. Um, I'll probably get to it sometime this weekend. Oh, Murph, there's just no internet? Uh, and you've already tried connecting uh, the ethernet to like another computer and it works? And if we can all ready up as soon as possible, you know, that, that'd be like the best thing to do. If Toad had a thing to do, he would definitely do that. Oh, Jacob, did I like Black Panther? It was a pretty good movie. I enjoyed it. Oh, we're not light blue. For a second there, I thought we were light blue. But we're pink again. Go team, Amy. What time zone am I in? Uh, Skyflyer, I'm in the Eastern Standard Time Zone. Oh, I should have kept spamming the button. Nice one, Alex. I'll get you back. It's only a matter of time. Oh, Sparkle, you're gonna let your sister play? Oh, is she, is she better than you at sniping? Is that what I'm hearing? Or seeing in text form? Hearing in my head? All right. What a shot. It only took one. Will, have I played Kingdom Hearts? I played it a very long time ago, and I played one and two and a little bit of Dream Drop Distance on the 3DS, I think. Well, that was another one. I think it was that one. Uh, but it's, it's been such a long time. I just, I have no idea what the story is anymore. And I know that's a very heavily lore and story-based game, and I've seen a couple videos on, like, the entire story, and I'm still lost. I do really like the gameplay, though. That's a lot of fun. And the secret bosses and everything. It's a very fun game. Come on, someone's over there. Or there. Great. Nice one, Alex. I'll still get you back. Soon. Just you wait. And Blue Guy, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. I'll be able to accept all and any requests uh, after each game. Just give me like two minutes. In Disney Cars, I'm not going to be the person to ask if you're able to join any particular game. It's first come, first serve. Um, that's just kind of what Nintendo does. I'm not really, you know, I don't have any host privileges, so I can't really guarantee anybody's uh, availability to join or rate to join the game yet. Oh, Sparkle, you're her teacher? So not as good as you. So I do have a chance to survive a little bit more. All right, they're everywhere. Blue team's everywhere, everybody. Everywhere I go. If I'm in Eastern Time, uh, then how do I stay up so late? I have a different schedule than everybody. Well, I guess a different... My schedule is offset because I work from 2 to 10.30 every day, so I just wake up in the afternoon and go to sleep at like 7 a.m. So not everybody has the same sleeping schedule as everybody else. You were spamming. I could have. If we had like five more seconds. At least we got like over 25%. Her name is Daisy, which is ironic. I guess so. <laughs> But yeah, Skyflyer, just basically take anybody's, like, I don't even know what a normal schedule would be. I imagine is like, 9 to 5, kind of, like, go to sleep by midnight, I guess. But, I mean, just take everybody's schedule and, like, uh, shift it advanced, like, 7 hours. That's probably my schedule. And we'll probably play Turf War for a couple or a few more games. Try to get through all the modes. Not can't clam blitz. Not yet. Calm down, game. Oh, 
Oh, Echo, you're working on three comics? That's gonna take a lot of time. Hopefully it's not too, uh, stressful or anything. Hopefully I'm seeing these names correctly. If not, I do apologize, but I'm trying to do my best to keep it as even as possible. And Cat Undercover, how's it going? Welcome back to the stream. Hopefully you had a fantastic Friday. Yeah, Disney Cars, I do apologize, but I I'm not going to be able to tell any amount of people to not join. I mean... There's, I have no power to do with that. The only thing I can really say is, if you've played a little bit, try and let other people join, but then you got people who don't want that. And Nintendo doesn't really set these up so that I have any sort of host privileges. Which is kind of lame. Like, I can't really kick anybody. And yes, blue guy, I do refresh and restart the lobby after every single round. Usually when there's o over, like, eight people wanting to join, I'll usually do that. Alright, man. That's a lot of teamwork there. Well, Master Smash, have a good one. Thanks for stopping by. GG, Nick. GG, Alequin. I was on a roll there for a second. Oh, David, are you still seeing everybody become a mod or something? Because that's... I think that stopped for me. Maybe it's just random clients to do that. That's right, out of your range. How does that- never mind. <laughs> Not eloquent range, apparently. And Alex, I know it has been 30 minutes, but there is, uh... Six sections of 30 minutes in, uh, three hours. So... To try and have a m around the same amount of time for each mode, uh, five modes out of three hours, there's some sort of math to be done there. It's definitely more than 30 minutes. Wait, did you... What? Where did you go? You didn't... You didn't... Oh, you just got sent back. Okay, that's right. You can't fall off anything with that, I think. <laughs> Too much math? Exactly. It's, you know... It's over half an hour... <clears throat> it's over half an hour and it's under an hour. Somewhere around there. Also, to try and close a game right at 30, the 30-minute 30 mark, a little difficult, and I don't really have to worry about it too much. And the real how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Renee, welcome back. And Dove, how's it going? Hopefully you guys all had fantastic Fridays. Oh, you're dead. Definitely dead, Nick. Take that dead. Come on, at least 20%. Did we get 20? What's going on? Oh, was it really waiting for that? Oh, we definitely got 20. 35. All right, that's a lot more than I thought we did. Math is hard and confusing. You try and stay away from it as much as possible. I mean, there's some, like, really good math out there, and then there's just some... A terrible, terrible math. I, I've heard stories about Common Core, and I don't really want to like believe it. <laughs> yeah, Unch. I'm not sure if like PE teachers yelling is like a good thing or not. I don't really 
no, maybe it's kind of like a drill sergeant kind of just like yelling at you to get stronger or something. I don't know, man. <laughs> Wait, there's good math. I mean, I guess only if you're really doing something that's math related, like coding a video game probably helps if you know a little bit of math. Like, I never thought I'd have to go back to geometry and figure out the uh, the formula of a circle, but turns out if you want to make circles in your video game, it actually really does help to know how to do it. There is good math, it's called calculus. Definitely not calculus 3. Calculus wasn't too bad, but 3? Man. Terrible. I guess not all terrible. Oh, is that like the first time I've ever spectated myself? But not actually myself? Oh, and it turns out I left. Alright. See you later, me. Smash Angel, how's it going? Welcome back to the stream. Thanks. I did have to look sharp for my friend's wedding, so I had to get my hair cut. Wait, David, you're an unbanned Switch hacker? Does that mean you've been banned before on the Switch already? Oh no. Oh, these are like the original colors for Splatoon 2. Not Splatoon 1, those are different, right? Where are you? You're somewhere out there. Alright. I got things to do. I can't keep a lookout for that long. What? A shot! <laughs> now, if only I could do that, like, every single time. Oh, I could have gotten a third. Oh, I should have, like, aimed a little better. <laughs> I mean, I had to get a haircut for my wedding? With Daisy? Listen, Tatsu, I think I would remember, uh, correctly if... If I were going to a wedding that was about me. Unless I just blocked it out. Who was I marrying again? Someone? Someone with the name of a flower? And Michael, how's it going? Welcome back. Hopefully you had a fantastic Friday. <laughs> there is good math. It's called addition. Addition's pretty good. <laughs> oh, someone's spamming. Come on, I thought I could take them. Nice one, Edwin. I was definitely gonna get that kill. Oh, the original colors for Splatoon 1 are orange and blue? Those are some good- that's like Rocket League colors. Those are like some of the best colors. Although it's probably because they couldn't decide to actually use red. <laughs> Smash Angel, can you be the best man? I mean, if there was a wedding, there's not gonna be a wedding. And the bride is definitely not gonna be a flower. I thought somebody had to have stood there. Chances I thought were pretty high. Turns out they weren't. Also, after this match, we're gonna move on to Rainmaker, and there's two of them there. Both who can outrange me. What's like Rocket League? Insidious, welcome back, and Ashley, welcome back. Uh, the Splatoon 1 colors are apparently uh, blue and orange. Which is like Rocket League. Apparently, uh, Nintendo and Psyonix were like, we can't choose red. That's, uh, that's such a bad color to choose for a competitive game. You know, it gives you that, uh, what was the, uh, the theoretical advantage or something like that. I'm sure game, I think game theory did something on that. Ulysses, am I going to play ARMS again? It should be on the schedule. Which is at LunarComplex.com. But yeah, I mean, I definitely plan to play ARMS again, that's for sure. Although, I will be not playing ARMS a whole lot when Smash comes out, because... 
as uh, as far as fighting games go, definitely gonna want to play Smash a lot. And also, like a Blaze Blue related game is on the Switch, so I gotta play a lot of that. How far is work from my house? It's not too far. Relatively close. And Ivan, how's it going? Welcome back to the stream. I did get a new haircut. Or my hair just kind of grows backwards, so that that would that would probably be something I have to like uh like figure out if that's bad or not, but uh yeah, I definitely got a haircut. An unknown, welcome back to the stream. Guess who? Uh I mean that's a very that's a very uh tricky question when your name is unknown. It's either it's you know it's one of the thirty something that are in Pokemon, right? All right, moving on to the next mode for tonight, which will be Rainmaker. Do I like game theory? Uh, I guess so. Yeah, sure. I don't really read too much into a lot of the thing, a lot of the, a lot of the uh, what would those things be called? A lot of the theories they go into, but there's some that are interesting. I don't really know what the uh, the negative part of game theory is though, because for some reason there's a lot of people that don't like game theory, like to a uh, to a point where they really need to make sure everybody knows. But I just it's interesting. <laughs> yeah, City is exactly when it when it comes time to the uh, Smash release night. If you ask me anything about arms, I'll be like, I've got two of them. Oh, you mean the game? What's that again? Oh, she liked my old haircut better. I mean, they did kind of cut it too short, but I mean, it just grows out eventually. Unknown, do I ship Springman and Ribbon Girl? Uh, no, I don't really ship any two characters like that. Like, I know nothing about their backstory or anything. Do they even know about each other? They're always fighting. <laughs> yeah, well, exactly. Isn't arms the things on your body? You know, hopefully if you got them. Oh, why does my me look different from what I actually look like? Because it's a digital image. And I mean, your me's never have to be an exact rep uh, representation of what you look like in real life. They're never going to. <laughs> I mean... My head's not that big, all right? <laughs> also, you know, there's nowhere said that, you know, they have to look exactly like you or anything. It does kind of look like what I used to look like, but... I don't know, I find it interesting that people kind of assume you should make them look like you. Like, that's never written anywhere, I don't think. All right, well, at least we got him. And we moved the Rainmaker just a little bit over there. Well, why don't you have a good one? Thanks for stopping by. And pretended gamer, I do apologize if it's difficult to join. That's just, I mean, if your ping is pretty, uh, pretty high, that's, it's just, it's, it's probably not gonna be a very good thing to try and join. But I'm sorry about that. Wait, David, show you the clothes in Splatoon 2 that I have on? You mean these? Like the names of them? Oh, I thought that was going to be like an all-out war between brushes. It was not. A little disappointed, not gonna lie. Alright, I think we're good. We're good. Go! Go for it! Did you make it? Oh, you're about to make it. Oh, you dropped it. You dropped it, man. Come on. <laughs> what? I was so close to you. I 
should have turned left instead of right. Big mistake. <laughs> now give us a twirl with the clothes? I mean, if I wasn't just in the middle of a video game. But I mean, I can show you what they are. Oh, the abilities on the clothes. Oh, there's something. I mean, I've barely really looked at them. I've done some of the uh, adding abilities and whatnot. Isn't there another way to check? Like an easier way to check? Maybe there's not. Alright, where are they? There's Insidious with a roller. Are you really using a roller now, Insidious? Do you not like the brush anymore? The Sazzles, how's it going? Welcome back to the stream. It's been a while. Hopefully you had a pretty awesome week. Alright, at least it was a draw. GG. Oh, what weapons do I usually play? Usually the brush, only because since I don't use motion controls, if I decide to use any other uh, actual aiming weapon, it's I'm probably going to be at a disadvantage because, I mean, everybody's probably using motion controls for the most part. So... Can't really use a lot of weapons if I want to, like, be able to aim as fast as everybody else. And then and Tan, welcome back to the stream. You don't have to apologize for being late. Glad you can make it. Hopefully you had a fantastic Friday. I got relatively close. It's not good. There we go. Oh, you didn't die? You got very close to death. What is a rainmaker? Uh, as far as I'm, as far as I know, it's a weapon that is uh, this weapon right over here. Splatoon. We should go this. Okay, well, I didn't fall off. Cool. The creator recommended motion control. I mean, I don't really care what the creator recommends. I mean, I'm gonna play the game how I feel most comfortable playing a game, which, if it's an arena shooter, definitely not going to use motion controls. And Unch, please be careful with the spam. I mean, you don't have to always say when you're leaving or when you're uh, showing up in the chat, uh, but I already did say, see you later. So, I mean, I feel very bad kind of saying that, but I'm not going to really try and repeat myself too many times than I already do. But, you know, you don't need permission from me to, like, leave the chat or anything. Oh, Insidious Rollers are fun? I mean, I did have a lot of fun using a roller before. Oh, you don't plan to main it? Are you sure it is kind of like a more um, centralized bucket? Like when you're using it as like a shotgun kind of thing? And on every you, unfortunately, I don't take weapon requests. Mainly because I'm not used to a lot of other weapons, but also if I accept your request to change to a weapon, I'm just gonna have to, like, accept everybody's, and I can't really physically do that. So I'm, I'm just gonna try and get as best as I can with what I've got and what I've been using for a while. Okay, you were in the last one. Who else? You. Okay. Alec, blasters are your jam? Blasters are... I mean, they're very effective. And Hyper, welcome back. And Lesser, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. And yeah, David, I'll check the abilities, but... I mean... I might wait for a little while to check them. I don't know, like, it's just... They're not really needed, and I kind of want to get on with the video game. I mean, why do you need to see the abilities? They're like... I tried to group some of them together, but... I'm not really sure how to get the, uh... Enough of the points. I think you need, like, 20 of that one ability to, like... 
actually pick what you want on your uh, gear. Well, Michael, have a good one. Thanks for stopping by. Alright, what's the plan here? Throw this over there and maybe it will work. <laughs> That's great, you ran right into it. That was a good idea. Well wow. At least I got somebody. That is right, you can't run away. Oh, come on. It was so close. There we go. Now I'll take this. Oh, no. No, no, not like this. Oh, and you got me back. All right. You probably deserve that. Where are we going, team? I guess we're going this way. That did not last as long as I thought. Oh, David, there is a way you can check without me checking? Because I figured there's, there's got to be something like that where you can check what players have used for uh, their gear and abilities. I'll just destroy, like, everybody. No problem. No, get back here. Come on. How did you not die? You got hit, like, 70 times. That's the exact number you got hit by me by. And Super Luke, welcome back to the stream. You like the haircut? It's not too bad. It's a little short for my taste, but I'll just get used to it. That's not going to make it. Goodbye, world. See you in like three seconds. Where is the... Uh... Oh, is it like over there? It is like over here. Now it's going over there and I'm dead. All right. Cosmo, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Hopefully you had a fantastic Friday. Alright, how far are they making it? Oh, come on. <laughs> really? That was... I was gonna love to make that jump. And you ruined it. Why am I jumping there? That's not worth it. Put an end to that, at least. Oh, let's see, you're right. The other team uh, is uh, definitely only three people in that team. How have we not won already? <laughs> oh, you got like two of us. That was a good shot. Squirrely, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Hopefully you had a fantastic Friday. I never said I was good at this game, so I mean, you know. You're really only pointing out the obvious there, man. And Preston, how's it going? Welcome back. Hopefully you had a fantastic Friday. Oh, please live. Oh, you died. Oh, okay. I think you died. Hey, that was my, uh, thing I was standing on. How dare you? I 
squirrel you're level 30? I mean, if you're if you're calling out somebody's bad for being a higher level than you. I mean, what's that really say about your level, really? Oh no, not the sniper. Not like this. Oh, where did you go? Oh, you actually went for the objective. That's smart. How do you do that thing where you jump and fly to another area? Uh, you bring up the map with one of the buttons. It's one of the four buttons, and then uh, you're able to move around with the joystick. I think the one that moves you, and then you just... Uh, or no, the other joystick that moves you. So I think the right joystick, and then you just press uh, A or something to jump to it. And now, when I am far aware that the level is the only amount of experience you've gained, not your skill. But if someone's calling me out to be bad, then, you know, I'm gonna fight back a little. Also, uh, they did apologize, and they just wanted to say something random. So they decided to insult me by saying I'm bad at a video game. I mean, what a way to start out with, uh, your first conversation with me. That's very smart, and, uh... Paints a real lasting image there. <laughs> Ashley, her level potato. It's very hard to accomplish. I've not reached there. I'm probably still at the seed level. And we still got a while for Rainmaker. Probably maybe a few more rounds. You were in the last one. Don't remember Spyro playing the game. Has anybody else seen a purple dragon running around? And then Antan, I do apologize if you are very slow at joining. I mean, it's it's unfortunately as Nintendo really loves to do, having their games like first come first serve kind of thing. Insidious, you love my sass. That's great. I, I try. <laughs> but, you know, someone's really calling me out. I am pretty bad at this game, and I do apologize. But, you know, hopefully it's for the better. One of these days, I'll probably not learn. What am I talking about? Lewis, how's it going? Welcome back to the stream. Hopefully you had a fantastic Friday. <laughs> Be aware of Octoling hackers. They'll come from all mediocre or um, yeah, mediocre directions. I don't think I've seen anything too bad yet. I mean, I've seen level manipulation, but nothing like equipment or gear. I no, I think I've seen gear maybe. I don't think I've seen weapons. Why am I always out of ink? How do you have two of those? Honestly. Oh, Jacob, did I see the Christopher Robin trailer? I did not. What is, uh... Is that the name of the movie? I thought that was our own teammate for a second there. I saw somebody swim in there. Who wasn't on our team. This isn't working. There I go. When do we switch back to Turf War? Uh, I mean, you don't have to always type in all caps, but uh, I don't think we're going back to it. Played about 30, 40 minutes of it already. We got other modes to play. And unfortunately, I don't have all day to really play this game. Oh, get back here. Where are you going? Stop dodging me. Alright, at least I got them. <laughs> And Super Luke, how's it going? Have I not already greeted you? I do apologize if I missed anybody, but... I mean, I try not to say things twice. 
Just because it's like a waste of time. In Disney, after this mode, we will be playing, uh, what is it, Splat Zones? That's kind of like concentrated turf war. Competitive turf war, like ranked, I guess. Who else is disappointed at the Mario Tennis Aces demo? Did you actually get to play the game? Because it kept saying services was down for me. And also, it is a demo. I mean, I wouldn't really take that as the real game in any way. Like, maybe a slight feel for the game, but definitely not the game as a whole. Oh no. They're coming from all directions! Make it! We got this! We got it! <laughs> that was a pretty good strategy. Oh yeah, that's right, you can't play it until June 1st. That's when the uh, the tournament thing kind of starts. We're pretending to gamer have a good one. Thanks for stopping by. And Andy, how's it going? Welcome back to the stream. And Super Luke, unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to join anybody's private uh, battle or match or anything. Just because I'm kind of streaming right now as a host and allow people to join in the game I'm playing. If, they, if I were to join someone else's lobby not everybody would be able to figure out like what their code is to join theirs as well so it would kind of be unfair <laughs> alex i did it it's it, it's a it's such an incredible feat you know knowing that i'm so bad at this game but i'm able to pull a win eventually oh lesser where's my rainmaker rank uh, i don't play ranked in this game uh, I don't have any sort of uh, time or team to practice daily with to play a game competitively. If I did, though, it would be not this game. This game doesn't... There are some points that this game has that are great, but then you have points in this game where it just... Nintendo doesn't take it as seriously as they should for me to really pick it up as a very competitive game. So I'd rather, lack for a better phrase, not waste my time. Still a fun game to play, though. But, you know, people are hacking it. Uh, you can't really change your sensitivity to make it kind of on par with people who do use motion controls. You can't, like, forfeit to... You can't vote to forfeit a match if one of your teammates leaves. There's just a lot of little things that kind of uh, steer me away from taking it very seriously. Also, the biggest factor is just I don't have time. Plus, private battles is a great way to get the most people in a game. Instead of uh, one of the other uh, modes, which is like three people, I think. It's, it's gonna explode. Come on, did I run out of ink? Something happened there. And Alexander, how's it going? Welcome back to the stream. Victor, welcome back. Hopefully you guys had fantastic Fridays. Okay, they're really close. I gotta stop this. And Alexander, uh, not doing too bad today. Got to watch the cool new movie, uh, Solo. Very good movie. If anybody is interested in Star Wars, highly recommend it. Was definitely worth it. Oh, are we up there? Oh man, we're way over here already. Oh, you had to... You had to go for a swim now? You couldn't wait? <laughs> well, Skyflyer, have a good one. Thanks for stopping by. And yes, Link, unfortunately, Salmon Run is not available tonight. It will be at 4 a.m., but I'm not going to stream till 4 a.m. Or until 4 a.m.? Stream will end before 4 a.m. There we go. Dodge that. <laughs> Uh, you almost did. How did that not get you? There's too many. I can only really take out so many of them. Oh, Alexander, you hope to see Solo next week? 
Yeah, it's probably not too busy. You should be able to. What what's really uh stopping you from like being able to not see it? And yeah, Super Luke, don't worry about it. I just I gotta kind of uh, explain. I, I tend to usually explain decisions I make a little bit. Like, why I, I'm kind of unable to really join anybody's lobby. In case anybody may also ask, like, right after. Where's the thing? Okay, we got it. Oh, you were behind. Okay, that makes sense. I thought you were, like, right there for a second. Echo, sometimes it's fun to play Splatoon with Joy-Cons. I don't not imagine that, just it's not really for me. Motion control wise, if, if that's what you're talking about. Especially if it's an arena shooter game. Also, I do like the a uh, little bit more area of movement with the uh, pro controllers uh, joysticks. How did you even... Did you see me before? I just realized I got one away. It's too bad they didn't get it. Oh, let's say your red Joy-Con's motion goes everywhere? If it's an actual issue, you should be able to return them back to, uh... Nintendo, and I'm sure there's probably a fee, and they should be able to fix it or something. Where's the Rainmaker? Where is it at? Oh, it's over here. All right. He got me in the air. Well done. That was amazing. I almost touched it. So close. Oh, yeah, Echo, I don't... Again, I don't not imagine that the motion controls are fun, but not for me. I'm sure they're a lot of fun for some other people out there, just they're not for me. Yeah, they definitely won. But it was close, right? Probably not, but uh, you know. I'm going to go ahead and imagine it was a pretty close game. <laughs> Why don't I say booyah? Why would I say- is that something you have to do? Oh, Alejandro, that was you? I mean, your sniper skills are, uh, you know, if you can snipe someone out of the air, I'd say they're pretty on point. You know, decent as best. Uh, or at best, I'm kidding. They're pretty good. And we'll, uh, we'll do one more Rainmaker and move on to, uh, Splat Zones after that. Did I see Solo in 3D? Yes. Usually if it's any movie that I'm gonna see, it's always gonna be IMAX 3D. I don't think Deadpool 2 was in 3D though, unfortunately. It was IMAX, but it said like IMAX 2D. I probably still paid full price, 3D price for it. Yeah, Lester, if there's something wrong inside the hardware, you should be able to have it sent back to Nintendo so they can repair it. Is it like the first uh, initial issue people were having with Joy-Cons? Wasn't it like the left one? Oh, Ashley, you hate 3D? It gives you a headache? I mean, I do, I do get kind of, uh, I don't know, I feel like my neck starts to like, become sore, but I think that's just because the 3D glasses, like, kind of pinch the back of your head. I don't know, that, that may just be me, but... 
Never really had a problem with uh, 3D or anything like that. Like, I could stare at a Nintendo 3DS for like 20 hours straight and be fine. And Alejandro, I don't use chargers at all. If it takes time to ready your weapon, I'm not a fan. <laughs> I would be a fan of other guns in this game, but I just, without motion controls, you know, I can't really get anywhere really with them than I can with the brush. Oh, that, that would have been a bad idea to go that way. Alright team, I'm gonna follow you, so... Let's, uh, let's move! Oh, uh, you died. Alright, who else wants to go? Uh-oh, they're up here. Somebody stop them. <laughs> oh, Spyro, it's your color. Or colors? Isn't gold also kind of Spyro's color? Why did I do that? I know you're gonna keep shooting that. Oh, Echo, like vertical or horizontal styled comets? Like which one's better or which one is better to choose? I mean, what's a... What do you mean by horizontal or vertical? I thought... I don't think I've ever seen a manga, at least, that is a... Uh, uh, landscape. They're usually portrait, like I guess vertical, but... I mean, the images can turn into more landscape... Uh, um, cells, I think they're called, like the boxes. Oh, Alejandro, I, I, I don't imagine that, like, you know, I'm using the best weapon, uh, or anything like that, but I'm not really interested in, you know, becoming the best at this game or anything like that. I just don't have the time to, and I don't like a lot of... Nintendo's uh, decisions with this game, but I mean, I'm just playing to have fun, and I really like spamming the brush, to be honest. Also, without motion controls, I'd say it is pretty much my best ad advantage I'll get at this game. Oh, come on. I should have just uh, went down. Probably would have lived. Oh, they're not going to win that easily. Or maybe they are. Because there goes three of us. Nope! Oh, you just... They just went right around it. <laughs> I apparently enjoy breaking my index finger. Uh, it's actually never been sore. I've played a lot of uh, Step Mania in my time, like, ever since 6th grade, I think. No, maybe 7th grade. So, like, pressing buttons very, very quickly is really nothing for me. It's very easy to do. Oh, Alejandro, you got your braces and it does not hurt? It doesn't hurt, like, in the beginning at all? Oh, Echo, for example, vertical is used in some comics where some are the horizontal-like in Webtoon. Oh, you're asking which way I like the Lunar comic to go by? I mean, I guess portrait or vertical, but I mean, usually in vertical uh, or portrait uh, sheets of paper, you can put different sized boxes that can be themselves portrait or landscape. Still little confused by what you mean, like, for example, of them like that. Ah, almost missed one. Pretty sure I've missed more in the past, though. <laughs> Ashley, you can finally clean your room thoroughly since finals are over. Good to hear that they're over. And you hate mess? Yeah, mess is terrible. Matter of fact, that's like one of the things I plan to do tomorrow is like clean everything possibly.
Well, blue guy, if you're gonna join every single game, uh, or every single other game, I mean, it just all depends. There's, there's a formula to what I do to be able to, um, spectate whoever. I mean, you know, try not to join every single game back to back, but... I mean, I do go down the list, and if I see someone who's in the last game, I do spectate them. And if I don't, then uh, I do eventually have to spectate uh, enough people to make sure only eight are allowed to play, thanks to Nintendo. Like, 5v5 would be amazing in this game, I think. Or if we could just get Ground War, you know. And the boy, how's it going? Welcome back to the stream. It's going pretty well. I saw Solo today. That was pretty much the highlight. Other than streaming, I guess. Although streaming was not technically the same day that I watched Solo. Overall, pretty good day. How about you? Hopefully you had a pretty good uh, week. Come on, you just kept... Walking backwards. That's very effective against me. What did I think about the last Splatfest? I mean, it was fun. I don't really know too much about TMNT, but it was fun. I always enjoy the, uh, the actual Turf War events. And the boy today has been really good. It's good to hear. And Universe 7, welcome back to the stream. And Julie, how's it going? Welcome back as well. Alex, welcome to the stream. Hopefully you guys had fantastic Fridays. Oh, Julie, you finally saw Black Panther today? They're still playing it in theaters, which is awesome. And you took your son to see it. He loved it. So have you seen Infinity War yet? Because I think that's, like, the next in line. And I believe there's some sort of chronological order out there. Hyper Alex, is it really embarrassing or bad that you like My Little Pony and watch it? I mean, I don't really... I mean, this is kind of going to sound... I really don't mean to sound rude about this, but... I mean, I'm not going to really care what anybody likes or dislikes. If you like a show, then you like a show. It has really nothing to do with me. I don't really know if it's embarrassing. I don't really know what people have really said about My Little Pony. I mean, I've never seen it, but it's a show. I mean, that's really all I know about it. I wish I could speed up this process. <laughs> oh, but I can't. Oh, Hyper, you're laughed at school? I mean, you shouldn't really be uh, focused on what other people think about you. Just kind of do whatever you want to do, man. And Jasmine, how's it going? Welcome back to the stream. Hopefully you had a fantastic week. Oh, Julie, you have seen it just before uh, Black Panther. I mean, there was a lot in, in, uh, I mean, I can't really say too much, but, uh, I mean, that shouldn't have been too much of a problem, though. And Disney, why are you spectating? Because throughout the list of the top eight people, seven people, excluding me, only one of them was in the last game before I got to the very bottom of the list, I think. And I have to spectate two people, so to keep it fair, I'm always going to do the same thing. So the only thing I can really tell you is try and join sooner, which unfortunately might not be doable, but I just can't do anything about it. And Alex, I think I will probably try and stream the, uh, the tournament, the Mario Tennis Aces online tournament. That's going to be next weekend, so I might be able to put something in the schedule. I'm not sure how the layout's going to be, though. Am I just going to be able to like stream it against people in the chat or am I just playing it online not really sure the um the mode or anything like that oh 
Oh, the boy who just came back from watching Infinity War? How'd you, uh... Without spoilers, obviously, but, uh, like... Did you like it? Did you not like it? Oh, they just got points. Come on, that was gonna be a perfect two. Come on, you missed. That had to have been a miss. It wasn't, but it, it sure looked like it. Alejandro, you feel like I would pick Daisy? Great. <laughs> I'm never gonna choose Daisy. And do they have different stats? I imagine each, each character has to be somewhat different. I mean, it'd be really cool if it wasn't so that it would be just skill versus skill, but I think Nintendo would make it so that they have a little bit of differences. Oh, don't do it! You did it anyway. Yeah, Alex, I did get the demo, but, I mean... You know, I don't know why they decided to release the demo and not be able to really do anything with it. But, uh... I do know the service is unavailable until June 1st. And I like noodles, not spaghetti? Is that a question? Not really sure I understand what you're trying to say, Alejandro. And Halo Legend, welcome back to the stream. Hopefully you had a fantastic Friday. Alright, why are they making a comeback? Team, what's, what's going on here? We can't allow this happening. This is not good. Look at this mess everywhere. We need to stop them. Am I creating a new room next? Uh, I usually do for every single match. All depends on how many people are trying to join. Usually, I will always be creating a new room every single time. Oh, not the bubbles. had to use the bubbles. It's really good for this mode. Alright, we finally took back control. So that's good. I guess I should head on over there. Can't do it from there. The boy has my week been? Hasn't been too bad. I have been on a little bit of a vacation from work because uh, my friend got married and I decided to take some time off. So it kind of started with that. That was kind of neat. Other than that, it's been pretty good. It's been all the same. Streaming, programming, playing some games here or there and there. Everywhere. I mean, let's be honest. Come on, we got like 20 whatever that is left. Or timeout. Well, Jasmine, have a good one. Thanks for stopping by. I like spiced noodles with a little bit of Daisy and her sitting next to me. I mean, you're saying this like it's 100% true and not fabricated at all, which it definitely is. <laughs> Julie, sorry you don't get the Daisy jokes. Uh, it's good to hear that I'm not the only one. <laughs> I mean, I understand... What is there? Or I don't even understand the origin of that. How did that even happen? And we still got about 15 minutes of Splat Zones, and then we'll move on to the next mode. 
which is control of the tower. It's definitely not tower control. It's a thing this chat does for some reason. I mean, that's about as, uh, that's about all the information that is, uh, really necessary to understand it, I guess. It all started with Mod Daisy saying that I listened to Hi, I'm Daisy. It went... <laughs> it all went downhill from there. Yeah, Daisy apparently always forgets that... Uh, we just keep forgetting her name and she always needs to keep reminding us for some reason. That's how it all started. Thanks a lot, Double Dash. You really just, uh... You've really done it, haven't you? Well, hello, welcome back to the stream. What does Rule 4 mean by Zeldas are fine? Uh, you know Link from Legend of Zelda? The, uh... The, uh, character in green clothing, usually? The joke is that... Do I really have to explain the joke? I mean, you really shouldn't put links in the chat, you know, like, uh... URLs, website addresses. But, you know, the joke being, like, Link is a Link, right? Like, uh... I'm doing a pretty bad job of explaining this, but yeah, I don't think I have to explain much more of it. Is it making sense? I hope it is. How have we not stopped them? What's going on? Also, why do we have a radar there? Uh, not really far from the, the base. There we go. Still got sniped. Well, Alex, I'm glad that you get it. Because <laughs> I was doing a pretty bad job at it, really explaining it. Oh, I'm gonna get sniped. Tried to go to, like, the left to really, uh, confuse them, but that did not work. How did that not? Okay, it did get one person. There was definitely like 10 hits there. Oh no, don't do it. Just forget that I'm over here. Don't worry about it. That was way too many misses. Please live. That's the one job that we both had and failed. Oh, going over there. Okay. When is E3? Uh, I think like the 13th, somewhere around there. I mean, I don't really remember off the top of my head, but I'm sure Googling it is a pretty quick way. It probably autofills like and gives you the answer, actually. I was... Just using my special, too. <laughs> Insidious, I'd bring a knife to a gunfight. Yeah, but they probably wouldn't have any bullets, so I think who's really going to win that fight? Also, yeah, the brush really cannot stand a chance against things that can really outrange it. 
Well, you know, what can you really do about it except changing your weapon? Which I'm probably still not going to do. <laughs> David, I brought two of myself and two knives to a gunfight. That just uh, doubles the chances that I'll win, right? That's what that means. <laughs> I'm bringing a paintbrush to a super soaker fight. I mean, who's really going to have the disadvantage there? <laughs> Not this guy, that's for sure. <laughs> I mean, no one says you can't throw the paintbrush. And those handles, they can really hurt. I think 10 people joined. That looks like 10. It was. <laughs> Chargers are the best. I mean, I don't know. I don't I don't like the way that you have to charge things up before. If there was like a cooldown, I think that would be better for like sniper rifles. I get that you kind of have to charge it up beforehand, but I mean, if it was just like maybe a sniper rifle from like any other uh, shooting game, I would probably consider choosing them a lot more. Also, look at what I just did here! Okay, well, don't look at that part. Just, uh, ignore that part. That part was, uh, definitely necessary. It was two for one. I think I still came out ahead. One of the benefits of bringing a, uh, brush. I can't believe you did not die. Alright, you're weakened, though. No, no. Come on, you were just in the range, too. I thought I had control of that. I'd say we're still doing pretty good, though. We definitely got this place covered. Why did I do that? <laughs> Great. I just walked right into that, too. Just minding my own business, not realizing that I was just gonna die. You know, I wonder if, if this isn't true, it should be, but like, the closer you are to the brush, the more damage it should probably do, right? That kind of makes sense. Also, was that a team kill? Oh, that was close. You almost rolled me there for a second. There we go, it's my little hiding spot that nobody's ever gonna know about. There we go, I feel like I do better if I just kinda do this sort of action for some reason. I can't believe that did not kill you. <laughs> well, look at that. The brush isn't all that bad. It's kind of effective. Probably at least not the worst weapon.
Although if you do have perfect aim, I mean, you know, probably not really a good weapon. Although the jetpack, though, is definitely a good, uh, a good way to even the odds there. Oh, Alec Wynn, were brushes worse in uh, Splatoon 1? Did they just not, not do enough damage? They did nerf these, right? Within like the year sometime when Splatoon 2 came out. Or I guess since Splatoon 2 came out. I know they did the buckets. Oh, were they just, uh... Did they have decreased damage in Splatoon 1? Nope. Can't forget you or you. There we go, I brought a knife and a gun. Oh yeah, I guess, you know, the jetpack kind of does, again, even the odds. In Disney cars, the best thing to do is not join every single time. Every other time is kind of pushing it. It all depends on how many people are trying to play, I suppose. And we'll probably play just a couple more of these modes and then move on to uh, Tower Control. Oh, perfect timing. That was also pretty close timing. Oh, you went back? I thought you were going to continue going around the thingy. The poster thing that was right there. Kiosk? What's that thing called? Oh, that's right. I do have the Hero Shot replica. Or what I like to call the P90. But, uh... Probably, uh, I don't know, I kind of like using the brush for, uh, streams and then, uh, that aren't, um, Splatfest, but then for, uh, Splatfest, I usually will go to P90. Oh, really? Out of ink already? Don't mind me, just, uh... Doing as much damage as possible. Oh, what a move! Alright. Did you... Oh, you probably could tell that I was that direction. There's no way you guessed that. That was, like, spot on. Oh, they got some points. That's not good. Team, they're getting points. We need those, right? Who is the lunar clone? It could be anybody. It could be me. It could. But probably not. Depends on the weapon they're using. That's definitely how you know it could or could not be me. And Mario fan, how's it going? Welcome back to the stream. My day so far, not too bad. Got to see the movie Solo. It was pretty awesome. Highly recommend. Would watch again. Maybe. But uh, hopefully you had a fantastic Friday and it was good. Oh, it takes forever to get over here. Alright. I feel like that thing was in the way, but, you know... Nintendo knows best. Yeah, Mario fan, I think Solo came out, uh... I mean, it was available, like, Thursday. I'm sure there were special showings Wednesday. It was around this time. I think May 25th was the official, like, release date. Oh, got away from that. That was pretty cool. Definitely intended, 100%. 
great. The bubbles again. Super effective. Mario fan, you had an amazing day? That's good to hear, man. Hopefully the weekend is better. Alright, jumping out of nowhere to save your teammate like that. Courageous, but like, not good for me. No, not at all. Hyper Alex, maybe I shouldn't just dive. Maybe I should strategize. I mean, if I was with a uh, team that I would usually play with and like practice with and we would all be in a voice chat, that's a bit different than playing with randoms. If it's randoms, I'm just gonna purely have fun with it. Maybe doing a little bit of uh, a strategic approach. But for the most part, I'm just gonna dive right in. I think we lost. <laughs> uh, what a comeback they had. Did we even gain a single point after they started? I don't think we did. Oh, do I was it going in uh, Chev 18? Welcome to the stream. Hopefully you guys had fantastic Fridays. Am I going to stream Captain Toad? Uh, when is that supposed to come out? Maybe. I've not played a Captain Toad, but I'd like to. In the cities, yeah, I'm probably gonna... Well, I haven't seen the first Ant-Man, but probably should see that before Ant-Man and the Wasp, and then I definitely plan to see, uh... What was the other? Captain Marvel. That's definitely a necessary one to watch. And Biff, how's it going? Welcome back to the stream. Hopefully you had a fantastic week. Been a little while. Alexander in July? Yeah, I think, like, Captain Toad, right? I do really want to play that game. Or, like, any Captain Toad. I just... It's... What are you exactly... Is it is it a platformer? Or is it, like, a search-and-find treasure type of game? And we'll play one more Splat Zone and then move on to Control of the Towers. Oh, almost forgot one. Alejandro, you feel like Smash is coming in winter? I mean, it's definitely going to be... Most likely, I'd say, if I were to guess, like, quarter four. But it'd be really cool if they're like... Oh, by the way, in, like, the E3 uh, press conference, they'd be like, You could download it now! That would be like... You know, I would definitely... Um, I guess, uh, except Nintendo's lack of internet connection stuff, if they were to just, like, release it during E3. I'd be fine with that. But it is probably better that they release it when we can pay for internet, or pay for their internet service, so we hopefully have better connections. Oh, Biff, will I stick to an Octoling when the expansion releases, or will I keep my Inkling? Uh... I don't really care either way, the gameplay is the same, I believe, but I mean, if the, uh, if the Octolings have better hairstyles, I probably will just choose that. I don't really like any of the hairstyles for an Inkling, so... Not really sure what they are for an Octoling. But I mean, gameplay is the same, I think. I haven't heard of any sort of changes to the, uh, character mechanics, depending on which, uh, Ling you decide to use. Have I ever been to E3? I've not been to an E3. I probably should have planned to go to this one, but definitely going to try for next year. Alright team, it looks like we're doing pretty well. Although everybody is still alive. That's, uh, we need to fix that. Alright, we did fix that. Wow, three. What was my favorite E3? I mean, uh, last year's was pretty good. But I don't remember too much from E3s. I just, like, specifically what happens at any E3, I just remember things are being released and, like, 
After that, I'm just like, I know that game is going to be out or something like that. Where is E3 going to be at? Uh, I forgot where this one's going to be at. Oh wait, did someone's Switch console like overheat and like shut off or anything? I mean, they're definitely supposed to get pretty warm to the touch, but I don't think they should... Unless they shut off, that might be a reason to reconsider like keeping it on. The match was rigged. <laughs> I don't know, Insidious. Definitely wasn't a warm-up match. <laughs> the Switch cannot overheat without unplugging of the internal fan. Well, I mean... I don't know. Usually computers tend to overheat with a fan. It all depends on how much dust is in it. And I'm sure there's other factors that can... Uh, cause something to overheat, but, you know. I've definitely had computers that I've built overheat... Even though the fans are all spinning at the uh, speeds they should be. But there happens to be like a layer of dust and whatever that's in between the main CPU heatsink and the fan itself. But I mean, when it's being played, there should definitely be warmish air coming out of uh, one of the vents. And yes, Ashley, uh, Grisco does not open until another 2 hours and 12 minutes and 53 seconds. And I mean, if you do end up, like, you know, not allowing your Switch to breathe, then of course it's probably gonna overheat. But a lot of, a lot of computers are designed to where, hey, if we're getting too hot, we should probably stop, and it should be safe. But it will probably shut off randomly. Oh, what are you doing up here? This is my tower, not yours. Get your own. All right, at least there was a lot of missing going on there from both parties. All right, team, we're looking good so far. All charged up, ready to go. All right, I fell right down here. <laughs> that wasn't really uh, executed well. Yeah, actually, exactly. If you if you decide to cover up the uh, any of the main intake or outtake uh, vents, probably will overheat. The fan can really only do so much. In Disney, I'm I'm probably not going to prioritize talking or responding to things that are mentioned in all caps. Unfortunately, that does kind of look spammy and uh, kind of attention grabby, so I kind of allocate my viewing of the chat to uh, other comments if it's going to be all caps. But I mean, this stream will probably be around three hours. They don't see me, right? I went for it. Got the tower moving a little ways. Instead, Bora, how's it going? Welcome back to the stream. You don't have to apologize, even if you're very late. Glad you could make it. Hopefully you had a fantastic week. Oh, you had to do that. You still died, though. Kill begets kill. And begets kill again. Triborg, how's it going? Welcome back to the stream. Hopefully you had a fantastic Friday as well. And Tatsu, how's my game coming along? It's getting there. I mean, very slowly, but... 
tomorrow's gonna be a day I spend either cleaning everything, like my room and whatnot, or, and maybe both, uh, rewriting the, uh, the game engine just so I can kind of develop, like, make the base of the game a little better, more optimized than when I first started, without knowing exactly what I needed to do. So I'd say it's going pretty well overall. Oh, I got one of the kills. I wanted both. There we go. That's two. That makes up for it. Nice shot. <laughs> Don't forget to update my RAM. Hard being a robot these days. I mean, a DDR4 memory is almost as cheap, if not as cheap as uh, DDR3 now. That was like the coolest thing that happened last year, is just DDR4 became as pretty uh, readily available as DDR3. And Stebor, I do plan to, now I'll, I'll go ahead and plan to make sure to try and play the, uh, the Mario Tennis Aces demo for uh, next weekend, I believe it'll be. I'll probably update the schedule sometime in the next day or two. But I'm not really sure how the layout of it will be. Like, if anybody... Are we going to be able to actually match anybody we want and play, like, multiplayer? Or is it going to be, like, finding a random person online? Oh, ran right into that. No way. <laughs> I thought I was definitely going to die from one of those. Especially being that close. And Blood Slayer, how's it going? Welcome back. You know what's up, just playing some tower control. Hopefully you had a good week. You hope that I had an awesome Friday? I mean, I did see Solo. So that was pretty awesome. Other than that, it was a very relaxing Friday. Oh, and Mega Rock, how's it going? Welcome back to the stream. You just got back from Solo, a Star Wars story. Uh, how'd you feel about it? You know, without any spoilers, of course. And Caleb, you need to see Solo. Do highly recommend if you enjoy any Star Wars to go see it. I think that's four and four. Yep. When I lose, it's called a warm-up. Always unless it's a good battle. Usually how it goes, Echo. Usually. If everything's right. There's been a lot of warm-ups. <laughs> and Pickle, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Hopefully you had a fantastic Friday. Oh, speaking of pickles, we are like a greenish color. That's, that's kind of, uh... I'm just thinking this is, uh, pickles. What time? Will, you really want to see Deadpool 2? Have you not already? I mean, you don't really have to answer that question. That's probably an obvious no, but do you plan to see it soon? What was the coolest kill a fan did? Um, not really sure. Uh, off the top of my head, I don't really remember, like, a whole bunch of ways I've died in this game. Oh, 
Oh, there's so many of them here. We got two of them. Well, that's good. Two for one. Awesome gamer, welcome back. I mean, you could dare me to use a sniper, but I mean, I'm not. I'm not going to, unfortunately. Like, if you dare me to use a different weapon, I'm gonna have to accept everybody else's dare for me using a different weapon. Where's the tower? Oh, there it is. Definitely didn't lose sight of it, no. Yeah, Alejandro, if your character's moving by themselves, you should probably get that controller checked out or something. They're definitely not supposed to do that. Alright, there's just so many things going on right there. How'd it take that long for me to die? I didn't get anybody? Come on. What's the coolest Rocket League goal I've seen? Um... I mean, I guess anything Jacer's really done. Those are pretty cool. Any sort of uh, ceiling ball reset. Any sort of ceiling... Okay, wall to ceiling. Um... Jump reset via the ball shots, I guess. Those are... I really don't know how to explain the type of shots those are, but... They're really cool. Wait, Julie, is there another new James Bond movie coming out? No way. Did, when did it... Is there a trailer for it? I don't think I've seen a trailer for it yet. I mean, you're... Yeah, you probably roll your eyes, but like... I really want to see that. <laughs> I'm not really obsessed with James Bond or anything like that, but I mean they've they've all been pretty entertaining movies. Oh, Mega Rock, you've uh, finally finished Ruby Volume Five this Wednesday. Man, I still need to see like volumes two and on. <laughs> An awesome gamer, I'm not going to play ranked. Uh, not as many people are able to join, I believe, because it's only uh, teams of four. And also, I'm not going to play this game super competitively. Just one of the games I'm not interested in taking seriously, unfortunately. Until Nintendo takes it seriously. But then I'm not going to have enough time and would rather try and just keep bettering my skill in Rocket League, to be honest. Like, I usually, as a gamer, I usually try and allocate most of my time to one thing, just because I don't want to become, I guess, mediocre is the bad word, but kind of mediocre at many different skills. I'd rather kind of perfect one skill than multiple. Alexander, about Solo, are there any other new vehicles besides Land Speeder? I mean, I'm not going to say anything about the movie. Or what's in it. An awesome gamer, I've never played Fortnite. I'm interested in Fortnite, but... Not enough to really try it out on my own with, uh... On the PC or anything like that. I've played PUBG before. And those kind of games just get too boring, uh... Way too quickly, just because the sessions take... A uh, pretty lengthy amount of time. But if Fortnite does get released for the Switch, which I'm sure it will, I'll probably try it out for a little bit. But I don't usually bandwagon on, like, games that everybody's, uh, raving about. Especially when it's, like, a concept I already am pretty familiar with. Oh, no. Okay, didn't die. Still good. Where does this ink keep coming from? There we go. Finally. <laughs> Julie, your husband watched the, uh... Oh, Marathon on James Bond? I mean, yeah, the movies are very predictable, but... You could say that with, like... 
a lot of mainstream movies out there. Like, like all in all, it's like the, uh, the, um, you know, the main character's probably most likely going to succeed in their quest or something like that. But I mean, James Bond itself is like a theme and a trope that you know exactly what's gonna happen. When is the update coming out for Splatoon 2? I think I've heard June 9th from some people. Something's gonna happen. Fortnite for Switch is going to be like a Mario one. When the characters where the characters are gonna be Mario, Peach, and Toad. I mean I'm sure they're gonna put some Nintendo themes in the game. They did that with Rocket League. I'm not saying Psyonix is like Epic Games, but, you know, why wouldn't you do that? And they're probably gonna have a daisy. I really hope they don't. Where's the tower? I'm completely lost. And Nintendo Dude, welcome back. 17 days until E3. That is not a lot of days left. Although it's more like 17 days until... Microsoft's press conference, I think. For Xbox. Isn't it more like 18 or 19 for Sony's and Nintendo's? Come on, how did that move not kill you? Where did you go? Oh, it shows where they're, where they're landing. That's how people know. I thought they were just paying really close attention to everything I was doing. Apparently not the case. There's gotta be someone over here, right? No? Where did they fall? Someone jumped right over here. Oh, there they are. Almost got him. Who's my internet service provider? It's a company. I don't really know if I should say which company, even though I have before. But it was the one that provided the uh, highest uh, download and upload speed available. Come on, I just, I didn't even attack the tower yet, and you're already attacking me. Which you should, I mean, that makes sense. Who do we have over here? I need to go away. Take that, Caleb. DZ, please? I mean, why are you so interested in my ISP? That kind of makes me a little concerned for some reason. I mean, I don't, I don't really think it should really matter. Awesome gamer, would I have a job as a football star or a job as a uh, manager? I mean, I don't really care about football. I guess a manager, if that's kind of similar to like starting up my own company. Is PlayStation uh, is going to be a competition Nintendo Switch? I mean, I don't think Nintendo has to worry too much about Sony. I mean, it is a... Uh, I mean, I guess they're kind of always going to have some competition there, but they're very different games. Like, there wouldn't be an issue with, like, so many people are gonna like choose Call of Duty on the Wii U versus like a Sony or Xbox console. They're almost not really competitions. There's more of a competition over Sony and Xbox.
Oh, DZ, you're having some assist. Uh, oh, you need some assistance with your channel? The one party being your internet. Uh, being as so. Oh, it's so bad? I mean, saying what my ISP isn't going to help you much, you should just check every single ISP you can get and see which one has the best rate. And maybe not rate of money, but like, see which one can give you the best uh, data rates, I think it's referred to. I forgot what it's called. Like, if you're going to stream, then you're going to need mostly uh, upload. Usually when you have a lot of upload, though, you're going to have... Usually you always have more download than upload. But, I mean, it's it's not going to... It's not going to be always the same case with, like, ISPs in different locations. But what I did was just check which ones have the best rates. And I was like, I'm going to go with you because why would I want lower rates? Like, an ISP is an ISP. Is Microsoft in competition with PlayStation? I mean, I guess so. I don't really know exactly. But like, I usually am only getting consoles now because of their exclusives. So there is no competition with like the games I'm mostly interested in. So like, if I want to play Mario, I'm going to get a Switch. I'm not going to get a Switch because I'm not in some sort of vendetta against any other company. It's just that's where Mario is, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get it and play it. Just like PlayStation, where Kingdom Hearts is. Even though that's going to be on other consoles, but I already have a lot more invested in Sony than I do Microsoft. Do I only stream? Yes. I do not have any time anymore for um, actual recorded videos. I used to make videos that were recorded in the past, but for the past year and... Uh, a little bit, I've just only been streaming, like, every day. Oh, get this off of here. Tower doesn't need satellite radio. I didn't get a... Oh, I did get someone! Okay. And two people. Nice. Awesome gamer, I have a lot of rules. I mean, usually a lot of streamers who take streaming seriously have just about as many rules that I've noticed. And yes, as David said, they are all very necessary. Matter of fact, there should be a little bit more, but I did have to add a rule where everything I say vocally is a rule. <laughs> uh, somebody had to test that. What a shot, Caleb. Well done. You got me. Do I like Wii or Wii U? Uh, never wanted to own a Wii U, so... Definitely didn't like it. But, uh, definitely like the, uh, the Wii that I had. There we go. I'm surprised I got you, Caleb. I thought you would be out of reach, but... Had to go all in. GamerX, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Hopefully you had a fantastic Friday. Not exactly sure who you're saying to subscribe to, but I do not uh, allow any sort of advertising. So if that's to me or to you, then please be careful not to advertise in the chat. It may be taken that way if you just say just subscribe. That was just a death trap. Oh, there was somebody on the tower. I mean, obviously, if it's moving toward us, it's going to be one of them on it. Get up there. Okay, there we go. That took way too long. Can I just get on the tower? No? All right. I'll just die. That's fine. Oh, 
Otaku, how's it going? Welcome back to the stream. I would ask, hopefully you had a fantastic Friday. I imagine you did with uh, playing Detroit. Hopefully it was a good game. I should have just aimed at you. <laughs> Instead of trying to get up there. Oh, you know what I could do? I could throw that thing. Like I never do. Well, at least it was someone different this time. Awesome gamer, do I watch Dashy? I've heard of this person, but I've not ever watched anything from them. But usually I only have time to keep up with a little bit of Rooster Teeth that I have been for the past 10 years on YouTube. That's really about it. I can't even really watch everything they come out with. They have like 50 different shows. Ashley, you're still in college mode. You feel like you need to work on an assignment. Yeah, I hate that feeling. Like you're... You're gonna show up the next day without anything done. Oh yeah, Otaku, I would imagine 100%ing a type of game like that would take longer than 24 hours. Hopefully. A Nintendo Switch looks like a Wii U. It looks like what the Wii U should have been. Is what I have to say about that. And Light Switch, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Hopefully you had a pretty awesome week. If not, hopefully the weekend's better. Did I watch Camp Camp? I've not gotten to Camp Camp. I've seen it, I've heard good things about it, but I've just... I mean, I haven't been able to watch Volume 2 and On of Ruby. There's just... I've always watched their, um... Uh, mainly their Let's Plays and Achievement Hunter series. Like with Michael Gavin and Ray back in the day. Rip. But I've been keeping up with, uh, mostly those series. Wait, did a ninth join? I think a ninth joined. Okay, so who was in the last one? You were? I think that's 4v4. Alexander, you'd say the Wii U is a beta version of Switch? That's... Yeah, considering the final version of Mario Kart 8 is probably going to be and has been released for the Switch. <laughs> it's almost game-wise as well. And Evie, have a good one. Thanks for stopping by. And Jamie, how's it going? Hopefully you had a fantastic Friday. Otaku, you think uh, you might like Detroit over God of War? I mean, if you do, then... Uh, is there a reason? Is... Uh, I mean, they're very- they're both very story-driven. Trying to think which one I would like more. I don't imagine Detroit is very, uh, button mashy or hack and slash. Also, uh, if we all could ready up as soon as possible, if not, I will block people who decide to, you know, stall the stream and take up my time and everybody else's time. And Caleb, you've heard Ruby is pretty good. Should you start reading it? Uh, I don't really know what they have written down. But if you mean watching it, I mean, I don't know. RVB kind of had the same, uh, the same sort of vibe with me when I first started watching RVB. But it does really pick up. But I, I don't, I have no idea about the manga. Yeah, in Cities, you love how they finally chose Ready when I mention it, and then somebody else doesn't choose Ready and we wait till zero anyway. That's just fantastic. What a waste of a minute. This is such a good tune. Like, I feel like I should be getting ice cream now. That wasn't ice cream. That was death. <laughs> Well, Stebor, we'll have a good one. Thanks for stopping by. What a shot. Alright. Nice one, Insidious. 
just killing everybody. That's right. They can't take the tower from us. Uh oh. They took the tower from us, everybody. This is not good. How did they do such a thing? And now they're racking up points. That's not good. Actually, you're just waiting for Clam Blitz. Yeah, I figured. We'll switch to it in about the next 10 minutes, probably. Do I like PS Vita? Never had a Vita. I'd probably really like the Vita. I just, uh, never really got the chance to purchase it. But I'd probably play it for a lot of the, uh, classic PS games for it. And yeah, David, I never said there wasn't a Ruby manga series. I imagine if Caleb was referring to the reading portion, I wouldn't be able to- I was only gonna say what I knew about the, uh, the videos they had. Like, I know nothing about the manga version or comic version, if they have that. Come on. Really right there? Shouldn't those, like, just keep rolling down the hill? Alright, that jump, jump did not work. Matter of fact, speaking of the Vita, I did hear this on uh, one of uh, Rooster Teeth's shows that the. Um, Apparently they've stopped making them, like actual physical Vitas now, or maybe about to. Don't quote me on this, it's just what I've heard. And I'm sure getting one just to like, really do whatever you want with it, like uh, what I usually did with a PSP. Oh, I'm sure they're probably really cool systems to kind of mod and get, get uh, emulators on and everything. live for a little bit longer or not that is always the next option Sony stopped making official physical v uh, PS Vita games I think it's the console as well like that they stopped production on them that is at least what I've heard nobody's up here oh someone is up here Where are they? There we go. Alright, maybe I should have just gone right for the tower. Oh, in Japan they are still selling them? Okay. So I still have a chance to get one to play like classic uh, Sony games if I really wanted to. Game man, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. May you ask why I use stick controls? Uh, cause I refuse to play motion controls for any arena shooter based game. Not a fan of any sort of, um, motion in the real world, uh, influencing any sort of input into a video game I'm playing. I know that motion controls are probably better in this, but I'm not at all gonna play this game, like, competitively, seriously. Also, I played a lot of Call of Duty on, uh, consoles, so I'd kind of just rather keep up with the, uh, same tradition kind of thing. The only games I consider playing motion controls are gonna be Wii Sports and, uh, ARMS. Just because ARMS it was more intuitive than not. But yeah, it's, it's a real pain that 
You know, we only have up to five sensitivity and it does not match what people can do with motion. <laughs> Julie, you're not a gamer. You have no clue what we're talking about. Which, uh, which, which part specifically? If you wanted to, uh, maybe learn about, like, what we're re referencing. We're still doing tower control, right? Okay, we still got time. Alright, you were in the last one, and you were in the last one. You get a spectate, you get a spectate, everybody spectate. Oh, the Vita? The, um, do you know what a, uh, have you heard of the, uh, the PSP? PlayStation Portable, I think, is that, is, if that's what that stands for? The Vita is like the next generation of that. Insidious, <laughs> you got the Oprah reference. Nice. <laughs> well, Caleb, have a good one. Thanks for stopping by. Also, Insidious, thanks for the, uh, the offer, but I think I want to buy a brand new Vita. If I were to ever get a Vita. I don't know, handed down things, I just kind of rather purchase my own from, like, brand new, sort of. Oh, Julie, you don't know what the PSP is? Think of the Nintendo Switch, but, like, from 13 years ago? I think 13 years ago. Maybe even more. But, like, for, uh, like, Sony consoles. Like, the PlayStation series. Although, the, the, the Switch gamepad with the Joy-Cons attached probably represents more of a PS Vita than it does a PSP. If everyone spectates, there's nothing to spectate? That's a very good point. Um, yeah, I guess just looking at the map probably isn't the most fun thing of all time. Oh, Alequin, I'm never gonna uh, spectate myself because I'm the host of the stream. I imagine that was obvious, but it may not be. I was just about to use my special, too. <laughs> Insidious, am I switching to golf after this? It took me like five seconds to realize what you're talking about. Uh, I thought it was bowling. Maybe bowling. Maybe it is golf. What's the real difference, right? Well, Alejandro, have a good one. Thanks for stopping by. Hopefully you had a fantastic time here. Well, I'm not dying this time. I'll be doing the exact opposite of that. Alright, how did the first not kill you? That what? There's no sense that was made there. There we go. Just go around you. You're not gonna expect it. Oh, come on. <laughs> of course there was one right there next to my face. In cities, you don't know, it looks like basketball? Dude, it might be tennis. The next mode might be tennis in Splatoon 2. So hopefully everybody's brought their, um, tennis racket with them. Have I ever heard of Wumi? Isn't it the thing that the, uh, the, uh, characters in this game say? That's about all I really know about it. Oh, come on. There's, they're everywhere. 
every way I turn, and there's a bomb there. I'm just gonna die again. Oh, they saw me. There we go. <laughs> you took way too long. You know, eventually in like a couple years, I really hope I can get as good to just like aim and fire and you're dead. That is kind of the, uh, I'm not going to stop using this, uh, weapon until that happens. That would take probably a couple thousand hours to perfect, though. So maybe, like, 500 streams. And said you brought your swimming gear? Close enough? That is close enough. <laughs> I mean, at least it's gear. <laughs> at least you attempted to be prepared correctly. Oh, Julie, your uh, son wants to play the uh, an Xbox One. Is it a good console, and do they have good games to play? They have good games to play. It really depends on what games your son would be into. Um, maybe he's not really into the exclusives for Xbox, but, I mean, I don't know Otaku saying, like, you know, get them the console that I would rather have them play, but, I mean, it all depends on what type of games they're into, if they have a sort of affinity for any of the exclusives for one or the other. Like, you know, for Mario and, uh, Legend of Zelda, that's kind of like Nintendo's games. It <laughs> does X Yeah, it's City's Xbox has exclusives? Question mark. I mean you got Gears of War and Halo. Uh that I know they have more than two. They definitely have more than two. What's another one? I can't think of one right now. But I mean the Xbox One I know the Xbox One S does outperform a PS4 Pro, but I mean I would really go with like the type of games you can't get on either console, which ones you would rather prefer. Which one has Fortnite? Uh, I think they both have Fortnite, if I'm not mistaken. Also, we're gonna move to Clan Blitz. Or I mean, uh, golf, tennis, uh, underwater sport. Every console has Fortnite. Every console except the Switch. So far. What kind of weapon am I using? Uh, a paintbrush. Yes, uh, Ashley, you have a good point. It also depends on what games you will allow him to play. Alright, hopefully everybody brought their, uh, their, uh, track attire. Whatever it is that we're supposed to wear while playing, uh, tennis. The Xbox One uses a Blu-ray drive. I mean, the controllers don't take actual batteries. So, that's a thing I don't really like about Xbox. I mean, other than that, they have definitely gotten better than things I didn't like them for in the past. No games that have a lot of killing that shows blood and real weapons? I mean, that's... I mean, both consoles have a lot of fun games that don't really have those sort of things. But I mean, Nintendo is really going to be your best bet, but... I mean, you know, when you already have Nintendo's console and you want another console, that's a very good question. What is my favorite game on PlayStation? I mean, the one I played the most is probably DDR. But series would have to be 
either Ratchet and Clank when I used to play a little bit of it or Devil May Cry. Those were really fun to play. How are they already down to less than 50? It's not even been a minute. What's going on, team? We gotta stop this. <laughs> is it E3 yet? No. Unfortunately, it is not. I wish it was. Just so I could know if, like, we're gonna have Animal Crossing or not. Oh, Jillian, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. I do apologize if I miss some people. I'm not gonna be able to get to absolutely everybody in the chat, so, I mean, I apologize for that, but, you know, that's really no reason to, you know, really get too, uh, upset and, like, type in all caps and whatnot, but. Oh, and more, your favorite PlayStation game is Jack and Dexter? Never got the chance to play that game. See, instead of Sly Cooper and Jack and Dexter, I, I would just kind of play, uh, Ratchet and Clank, unfortunately. Or fortunately. There wasn't many games I could get for it, but... Oh, there's some over there. How do I get back over there? Oh, and they're gone. <laughs> I did see two over here, though. There we go, already up to six? Look at that, there's four right here. Alright, now nobody, uh, kill me, please, don't. Just don't do that, I said don't. Come on, Alec, win. I was about to say, we gotta make it interesting, but it actually is pretty much tied up. Well, Jill, have a good one, thanks for stopping by. Oh, you want to go? Bring it on. All right, you win. I retreat. Great. <laughs> There's like their entire team right there. Well, I mean, Alexander, isn't Kingdom Hearts going to be on Xbox? I think I heard someone say that. I mean, honestly, it should really be about the exclusives you want on whichever console offers them. Like, if you want more Mario games, definitely get Nintendo. If you want more insert Sony exclusive game here, like God of War, then, I mean, definitely get PlayStation. But if you're into Halo and Gears of War and what Microsoft can only offer you, then definitely get an Xbox. But I'd take into consideration a lot of other things, too. Especially some things in the past, like... Needing to always be connected to the internet, like Xbox did before when they first came out with their X. I think Xbox One started doing that, or like having being forced to buy the Kinect with it, and then batteries for the controller. I still don't understand why you have to use batteries for a controller. What's the next game coming out for the Nintendo Switch? Uh, I'm not sure, but. Any game that is going to be released should be on the, uh, the store at the top of the page for what's next, I think is what they call it. Not exactly sure what game it is, though. Oh, how dare you, Alex? Steal my clans and then kill me. In a draw. Was not expecting to die. I thought I had the upper hand. Definitely wasn't going to be able to get away. Yeah, if Kingdom Hearts 3 is going to be on Xbox, then, I mean... I think you could get most of the series on PlayStation. But, I mean, if you're, if you're a big Kingdom Hearts fan, you probably have already owned a PS2. And at that point, probably have just gotten 3 and then 4.
Yeah, Insidious. There's been Kingdom Hearts games for like Game Boy Advance, DS, 3DS, uh, PSP, other consoles as well. I do know about that. I can't remember what I said like an hour ago about it, but I didn't mean that it was only exclusively on like, uh, whatever I was saying. Kind of annoyed though, that they, like they basically were like, they probably weren't like this, but you know, like, if you're gonna play Kingdom Hearts all of the games, you're gonna have to own like all of these systems. Thanks. I mean, I did own most of them, but still. Would have been great to play all of them on like one console. You were definitely in the last one. I remember with the flashbacks of last game. Almost got you. Well, game man, have a good one. Thanks for stopping by. How come Microsoft, uh, they get exclusive games? They probably own, uh, one of the reasons would be, like, owning the studio. So, I think, like, Rareware? Didn't they buy that? Or something? For some reason they had to like... You couldn't have Banjo-Kazooie or any sort of rare games on like... Like Microsoft bought them I think. Something like that. Like at least got the rights to only them. How do we play this mode? Uh, you collect clams. Once you get 10 you can uh, get through the enemy's barrier if they have a barrier that is dropped. And then you throw clams into the basket that appears. Okay, David, so I guess Microsoft did buy Rareware. Something about Bungie as well. I'm not sure if, like, they bought Bungie, you know, for the Halo series when they were first coming out being an exclusive, but, uh, there's some sort of legal reason that, you know, you're only gonna get Halo games on the, uh, on an Xbox console. Is that- whose side is that? What's going on? How are they already down to 35? Oh, that's our side. Great. Before a minute? You're kidding. No way. No, no, no. Great. <laughs> Less than a minute. Alright. That was obviously just a warm-up. <laughs> What happened there? Jeez. Okay. Since when was that a thing that could happen? <laughs> Alright, well, um... Yeah, uh, just not gonna at all talk about that. <laughs> Man, I didn't know you could win it that fast. Cool, Jay. How's it going? Welcome back and have a good one. Thanks for stopping by. Hopefully you had a fantastic week. Alright, plan B. Uh, don't end the game in like less than a minute. That was like 50 seconds. That was like the opposite of the overtime we had a long time ago of like 7 minutes or 5 minutes overtime. <laughs> We're gonna rematch. You cannot accept this. Yeah, that is a pretty unacceptable end to a match there. It's got to be like two out of three, right? Although we're not gonna have the same team. Unless you know Nintendo if you're out there and listening. Tournaments. Having that set up for this game would be pretty fun. I'm not gonna keep track of my own bracket or anything.
Otaku, your wallet won't be able to handle E3. Yeah, if they release anything on the date of E3, it'll probably get worried. Like, oh no, it's gonna hit me. The real, why are you spectating again? Unfortunately, if you're at the bottom of the list and I go through and check, and there's not as many people that were in the last game, then I have no choice but to spectate somebody. And so the only, the most fair person to spectate is gonna be people who didn't show up fast enough. Unfortunately, it is almost like first come first serve with Nintendo games. Did I play Salmon Run today? No, you. Uh, it was not open since I uh, started streaming. It's still not gonna be open for the next hour and 18 minutes and 48 seconds. Giovanni, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Hopefully you had a fantastic Friday. Hopefully no clams appear like at the further end. That'd be kind of lame. Great. Dodge Roomba's there just to get hit by another Roomba. Insidious, are you worried about your heart instead of your wallet? That's a good one. Oh yeah, Julie, I'm glad there's, um... I mean, the private battles aren't a good way of streaming the game for everybody to join, but it's like the best way we got, and at least we have something like this to play. Could be better, though. They could, they could actually have me, like, become a sort of, uh actual host to the lobby I've made instead of just kind of a participant but you know Nintendo can only allow so much Lanoob how's it going welcome to the stream hopefully you two had a fantastic Friday come on I, I was attacking first nice helmet though that's a pretty cool helmet It'd be a shame if something happened to it. And the noob, I'm doing pretty well. Cannot complain. I am sort of on a vacation. So that's fun. That was very well deserved. Vacation from work, though, not from streaming. Yeah, Alexander, one of the things that's kind of annoying about Splatoon 2 is you can't randomly play uh, Salmon Run whenever you want, unless it's local. Yeah, only for private local matches, not for online for some reason. Nintendo really likes to enforce a theme with their video games and kind of apply that to limits. Pamela, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Hopefully you had a pretty awesome week. Right, there's gotta be someone over here. There we go. No football for you. Oh, great. <laughs> I didn't notice that was there. Like always. Pamela, I'm not doing too bad. I got to watch, uh, got to go to the movies and watch Solo. That was awesome. Uh, other than that, in doing a little bit of coding and streaming, that's really about been my day. Alright, we were both very confused just then. I didn't see the bomb? Uh, yeah, I didn't really notice it. You know, that kind of happens. Happens a lot more than it should, but, you know. I was focusing on throwing clams to somebody so that they would get the, the uh, super clam. Or the football. Yeah. I should have stepped away. <laughs>
Well, Pamela, thanks for the sub. Appreciate the support. Hopefully you enjoy the, uh, the many streams that will be in the future. And not the past, because those are done and over with. Throwing them anyway. How's, how am I alive? All right, there we go. <laughs> Julie, what is with the ramen thing? Uh, ramen is number one. That is, that is all you gotta know. Like, as a food. It is the best. Like, if Toad was a food, and yes, there is a Toad thing, uh, he would definitely be ramen. There's no doubt about that. And Lanoob, if you would like to join, feel free to send me a request. I won't be able to type in... Uh, people's friend codes myself, but I do have my friend code in the description below. I do restart every lobby and accept all and any requests that are pending. Am I taking off work for my wedding and honeymoon with Daisy? Uh, no, my friend had the wedding and I know nothing about this Daisy. <laughs> of what you speak of. Like, I can't, like, honestly, I can't remember the last time I saw a flower. Or a daisy. <laughs> like, a daisy flower. Uh, there are flowers in the kitchen right now, actually. Oh, Julie, you actually had some ramen tonight? Do you mean ra- You mean ramen, right? Did I not miss anything? And Red Striker, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Hopefully you had a fantastic Friday as well. And the Demon, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Hopefully your week's been good. If not, hopefully next week is much better. And I think that's Nine who joined. So I gotta spectate somebody. And the person is you. You were in the last one of the people I started going down the list from. And Ronald, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Hopefully you had a fantastic Friday as well. After this match, I'll be able to accept any and all friend requests. And I will be only streaming for about maybe 15 more minutes. So that's probably going to be enough for... I mean, it could be like one or two games, but... I think they'll last a little shorter than eight minutes. Oh, Julie, the sodium is so high. Yeah, ramen has... You gotta you gotta watch out for that. <laughs> what if there were ramen flowers? Oh, like honeysuckles. Like, you just... You sniff them and it smell like ramen... Oh my god, that's gotta be a thing. And if not, that should be. Alright, team, let's do this. Collect the clams, uh, something after that, and then profit. Not the bomb again! <laughs> Actually, you always do that, but at least this time, like, you didn't get away. Usually you would get away. That is not what happened today. Stop chasing you? I mean, you're just the one in that location. Alright, that wasn't going anywhere. How many people can I add on the Switch and PS4? I think I heard PS4 was like 2,000 or something. But uh, on the Switch, I can only add 300, so... Anytime before a stream where I need to accept requests for people to join, I do always delete maybe around like 50 or so just to make sure I always do have room I'll get back here who is this see I don't even see the names oh it's Alex GG Alex G G maybe next time probably definitely next time you'll probably kill me can't wait Make it with the football! <laughs> That's such a miss. Can I get somebody? Anybody? 
How were all of those a miss? I can't believe it. <laughs> Did I say 4,000 on PS4? No, uh, 2,000, I think. That is just what I remember. That is probably not right, but I do know it's a lot more than the Switch. And yeah, Insidious, I have been meaning to kind of, like, go through and actually delete everybody, at least at one point, especially after the anniversary stream, but... I mean, I still don't really need to do that. I've kind of figured out how many people there is a chance of being able to join during a stream. And... Yeah, probably for Smash, I'm probably gonna have to remove everybody. But I mean, anybody's more than welcome to send the request again, like, right after. Oh, the barrier's up. Of course it is. GG, Alex. Nice draw. And then where I'm not gonna get the uh, NES, but the only classic, if you're referring to the classic, the only classic I'm really wanting to get as a uh, physical copy, because I think the uh, paying for Nintendo Online or whatever is gonna, we're gonna get some free NES games with it, I believe. I'll just wait till then, but. I'm only going to get a classic if they come out with, like, a Nintendo 64. Which I really hope they do. I'm pretty sure that's got to be the next one. Oh, you put a bomb there! Great. At least I didn't die because of the bomb. <laughs> Nintendo should update that number. I mean, they should really make it so that their friends list isn't one-to-one. -one. Like, if I remove somebody, I get removed from their list. It shouldn't work like that. You should really make it so that everybody can add, like, the same... Like, thousands of people should be able to add one person. Did that make it? I don't think it did. Oh, come on. That must have been close. Like, they really need a, a, a one-to-many relationship for their friend list. Come on! How- what? Now I can't even reach it. Oh, I can't. There we go. That was... easy. Or an easy button when you really need one. Oh. Just needed one. Cool. Glad I could help, team. We did it. Definitely not defeated this time in like less than a minute. In the demon, I do again check every single match. Uh, the request sent to me. So you do not have to worry. Although it's not going to be easy to join. Uh, but if you have played before, let's try and get new people to join. That would be best. And then, Kniya, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Hopefully you had a fantastic Friday. How much longer for the stream? Probably 10-ish more minutes. And yeah, Insidious, I really wish you could, like, block invites to Rocket League. That'd be great. You know, that is kind of... A little bit of an issue. And what am I doing out here? There we go. And yeah, you did have a fantastic Friday. Well, that's good to hear. Hopefully the weekend is just as fantastic. Ashley, I know that you leave uh, ink bombs behind. How do I fall for it? Well, I'm not even... I don't even know who it is that I'm following. Like, sometimes the name just doesn't appear, so... But if they leave an ink bomb, like, that changes everything. Pretty sure I know who I'm following. Oh, I said your name wrong? Do you prefer Ink Nia as a whole, or just 
So Nia isn't fine? I do apologize for trying to short the name. Oh wait, you were in the last game. That's only nine who joined, so that should be good. And then, were you like PlayStation? It's good to hear. I mean, it'd be good to hear if you liked Xbox. I, you know, good for you liking what you like. Oh, it's Ink and I, uh. Okay. So usually I would just assume that would be Nia, but if it is not, I do apologize. I've never heard of a pronunciation with uh, N-I-A being an Aya. But I'll try and remember. Unless you- unless it's pronounced Naya and not N-I-A. Uh. <laughs> this is why I don't like the English language. <laughs> Oh, and we're like the best color ever. A good luck yellow team. Not gonna do as good. Being yellow, going for tails. He may be super smart, but uh, eh, this isn't really dark blue. This can't be Sonic. I mean, I'm seeing that name as Sean Nia, so that's not gonna help. I'm not gonna, you know, I don't know too many, I'm not sure who that is, so that doesn't really help. Alright, there are two of you? That doesn't make it easy for me. When is the N64 coming out on E3? Uh, it's not going to be possible because the Nintendo 64 is a older Nintendo console and that's not going to be for any E3, I would imagine. She is a country singer? Uh, never, I don't, I'm pretty sure I have not heard of her. Also, it's very difficult to to really know how to pronounce any name because, I mean, any it really depends on the person. You can have somebody spelt the same as somebody else, but have them want it to be pronounced something different. There's no right or wrong answer except to the person who's that named, is named by. Anwar, what do I mean? Uh, the N64, the Nintendo 64, has already been out for, like, more than 20 years? So it wouldn't be something at E3 if it's already been released. What is my friend code on the Nintendo Switch? It should be in the description below. With a lot of other useful information. Oh, come on. Were you just... Just hiding there? Alright. Just having the clams come to you? That's not a bad idea. And nobody's scored anything yet. That's... That's interesting. Pretty good match. Well, there's nothing going on, really. You know, points-wise. I should have known the range was gonna reach me. Oh, you charged up. I saw that. I did nothing. Names have no errors? I mean, to the person named, that is, uh... Well, I mean, you can mispronounce someone's name. That's, that's the same as an error, I guess?
But I mean, the English language not being very phonetic is just the worst thing ever. All right. What a shot. That was very abrupt. I'd like to at least get like, I don't know, 50 feet out before dying. Like maybe over here at least. Oh, Halo Legend, have a good one. Thanks for stopping by. All right, we have 35 seconds left. Can we make a comeback? Oh, you're all the way up there. All right. What's going on? Where are they coming from? Were they up here? And Sarah, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Unfortunately, I can't go back to Turf War. I do uh, usually stream for a few hours in Splatoon 2. I do go through all the modes, just chronologically. So we did already spend some time playing Turf War. I didn't even know there was a second person there. But this is toward the, uh, the end of the stream. I'll play one more, uh... Clam Blitz after this, but this is unfortunately toward the end of the stream. They definitely won, didn't they? Wasn't even that close. We could have had, like, a good comeback, though. We'll get them next time. Errors come from the person who types the name? I mean, you could type it in a way like, you know if you Google a definition of a word and then you have the, uh, the, um, like, you know the up uh, the upside down E? Like how that's supposed to be pronounced? Like dictionary form of pronunciation? That's like absolute. That's very nice to have if, like, you could remember what those are. Because <laughs> that's just a direct translation between, like, how something sounds and how it's written. Oh, and that's like the best. That's that's the color. That that is what I'm looking for. That matches 100%. All right, so we're gonna have one more last round before the stream ends in Clam Blitz. Good luck, everybody. How come I don't play Rocket League on Nintendo Switch? Cause it is uh, unacceptable. <laughs> Uh, I mean, it's, it's, it's like playing, um, it just doesn't run full FPS, and there's a lot of issues with it. There's a lot of delay, it's not a good resolution to play the game in, it's, uh, again, the FPS is really low compared to what I usually play on, and it's just, it doesn't perform as well. And when you play a game that you take very competitively and very seriously, for the most part, you don't want to play a game on, like... You don't want you don't want to play your favorite game on something that doesn't run it fully. It's a very lack of the rocket and the league when it comes to the switch. And Super Sid, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Hopefully you had a fantastic Friday. And TV, how's it going? Welcome to the stream as well. And Inc, have a good one. <laughs> Thanks for stopping by, and I apologize for not being able to figure out your name. I mean, if anybody uses hiragana or katakana, the Japanese uh, alphabet, I'll definitely be able to know how to pronounce something correctly. But uh, that is probably most likely not ever going to be the case. But it is great that that language is very phonetic, and if you know how every character is pronounced, you could read everything and anything. Like, flawlessly. That's not the case with English, at all. Oh, I thought I missed. Oh, I was gonna be so upset for like a second. Oh, didn't you just use the special? Did that go through it? 
When is the next Nintendo 3DS XL coming out? I don't think they're going to keep up with the Nintendo DSs. I imagine if I were Nintendo, I would definitely go uh, all in with the uh, the already portable <clears throat> Nintendo Switch. Oh, Alexander, you uh, your cousin says Korean is easy. I did watch a video a long time ago about the Korean alphabet. It is very phonetic as well. Like, if you know some certain uh, written characters, you can pronounce everything as well. Like, you can read everything. You know, unlike English. Like, thanks a lot, English. Why well, you gotta make, make up letters in the middle of words or at the beginning of them, like pterodactyl or knife or uh, what's another one? I can't remember. Q. Like, Q is an annoying one. I think it has five letters, or three, or one. <laughs> Who knows, really? Yeah, Julie, I'm pretty sure Korean Alphabet just has, um, like, types of each character where it's a set of ways to pronounce something and there's no gotchas. Like, I'm really talking about gotchas in, like, the English language that a lot of other languages don't have. Like certain parts of words you're not supposed to pronounce or anything like that. Pretty sure it was the Korean language. Oh, you did follow me. That was a mistake. And you paid for it. Words like two more clams. Hello? Need like two more? Anybody? Oh, they're over at our base. That's not good. I'm just waiting. Like, is it better for me to wait here? Okay, it's definitely not. So it's not better just to stand still. Oh, Julie, you say things, uh, differently to elders than young people? Oh, that's, that's just confusing. <laughs> I mean, that's probably similar to the, uh, in, in Japanese, there's a whole bunch of different type of endings depending on, like, if it's, a uh, casual speak, or is it, like, uh, I guess for royalty and other things like that. Tatsu, is it okay for Infinity War memes in Discord now? I don't know. Is there a, a generally accepted amount of time for things to be spoiled? Uh, the only thing I could really assume is like, or guess best would be like a month, maybe? I imagine a month would have, uh, would allow anybody who's really serious about a franchise and would care about sp people spoiling things, would have enough time in a month to actually go see it. Oh, with Marvel movies, there's a two-week grace period? It's only two weeks? I mean, if that's widely accepted. <laughs> hmm. I guess... Should I go ahead and make the executive decision? When did it come out? It came out like... Almost a month ago? Yeah, it should be fine. You know, you could quote me right here, right now. Three hours and ten minutes into the stream. Yeah, it's been quite a while. It should be fun. A scripted match? I don't think so. <laughs> But, as scripted, uh, you know, since I said this would be the last match, like, a match ago, that is going to be the end of the stream of Splatoon 2. Hopefully you guys enjoyed playing 
some Splatoon 2, or watching if you did not actually join in any of the games. Uh, tomorrow's stream will be, uh, what is it? Green Mario's Balloon World, so still not have uh, been able to 100% that game, but hopefully in two more streams, probably get to rank 50. But with that said, hopefully you guys again enjoyed your time here and have a great night, day, evening, breakfast, lunch, and or dinner.